It is Tuesday. Yeah, I think it's Tuesday. Yes, Tuesday. And I'm working on putting my goals video together this week. And I've been waiting on a calendar to come from Fizz and Flourish. And it's arrived. It actually came yesterday, but I didn't have time to open it. But we're going to open it now and uh, get started on working on it. And uh, I think that's mostly what I'm going to be working on this week when I get the time. Um, probably do some sketches in the meantime as well. I still haven't got my iPad, but hopefully that'll come in the next like two weeks, maybe. I'm getting somewhat patient. Anyway, I will change the camera angle and we'll get this open and see what it looks like. I always try to tear packaging so easily because I like to reuse the packaging and see how well I do at this. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, well. the colors. Nothing like a very good job with hammer. <laughs> I can't wait to use it. Um, <clears throat> so I'm hoping to use it mostly for like social media planning. Um, if you watch Monkey Mantaka as well you'll see she did a video on her planning for this year um, and I really like the way she did it all color coded so I'm gonna try that out and uh, yeah I'm excited to Get started, and there's so many leaflets in here, so this will last me ages. I have another two packages waiting to come. Uh, I got a couple of stickers from Monkey Mantaka, and I got some stuff from Butcher Cult as well. She just had her shop update. I'll link both of them below and Fizz and Flourish as well if you want to check them out. And I will probably show you those packages when they come as well. But for now, I'm going to go get planning. Talk to you later. I've just oh, okay. I've just finished doing my chatty part of what is going on? I'm 
good okay so just finished my uh film and my chatty perk of my 2021 goals i know it's already nearly the end of january and most people put it up at the start but whatever better late than never um i've been going through my list and my bullet journal trying to tick off all of my to do's uh, I have to just be way more organized than I was last year because I now have a tiny human to look after so I cannot take my free time for granted although it is very difficult to choose to do work instead of napping I would love to be having a nap right now anyway just on my goals uh, video um, I've got some b-roll I think I want to film for it and then when that's done I hopefully we'll be able to get that up on Saturday um, by the time you see this video, Gold's video should already be up, so I will link it somewhere um, if you want to check it out. And what am I doing next? I'm going to try and edit some of it now and then see what B roll I have left to film. I've already filmed some of me filling in um, my bullet journal and my lovely new planner from uh, Liz and Flourish from Meg. I will link her shop below. Um, going to use that to do monthly planning of social media and that kind of thing and I think I need to prepare some more Instagram posts I'm trying to do it three times a week but I might change it I'm just kind of playing around with my time on that um what I've been doing at the minute is I will kind of have an idea of what what posts I want to put out um, and then I have in my notes section on my phone uh, the different like headlines of what, what I'm going to do um, so that whenever I am trapped under a sleeping baby then I can do captions for my Instagram and try to use my time wisely um, and that's been working pretty well for me I'm still kind of getting used to the whole flow of how to organize my time and how to use my time as best I can um, and hopefully even once that kind of settles and I have a routine then I'm thinking about doing a video of like first time mom trying to set, set up a business what I do in my day to get things done um, so if you're interested in that let me know I'll probably have all sorts of different routines going to get this done um, if you've seen my goals video you'll know that I'm trying to open an Etsy shop by April so I've got lots of things to do but for now I'm going to go finish editing what I can before my husband gets back because he's taking the baby out for a walk and I am limited on time so I'm going to go edit and I will check in whenever I next have a minute so I thought I would finish off Ooh, I thought I would finish off this video uh, with an impromptu kind of journal spread also small business hole kind of thing um, I did this I need to finish it off um, I'm gonna use some stickers and I'm just gonna jazz it up a bit make it a little fun so I have a few things that I got from April in Monkey Mintaka so I ordered this bird sticker sheet and I ordered these cute are they hamsters i think they're hamsters um but i'm gonna put this on my laptop um but i also got a couple of freebies which are super cute a little kitty cat a little bird and then i also got stuff from lil from bougie cult um let's see look at these moon face stickers um, that I was going to put on my personal calendar and I also got washi tape which this is so nice so I'm going to use that in my journal as well and then I got some freebies um, I got an art print I have it on my wall at the minute um, and this book mark so the art print is um it's like a little postcard size it has the same artwork as this on it so i've got it up on my wall behind behind you there um 
cute little thank you card. A little freebie. This is a cute. I have been thinking about doing a tarot journal, so I might save this for that. Um, and then these two. So a bucket ton of stuff from Bridge of Hope. <laughs> so many freebies. Very kind. Thank you. But I was thinking of putting, let's see, maybe some of the birds. Some of the cute birds onto my goals spread. But I need to finish the writing for it first. Uh, I also got stuff from Alice Woolley that I bought for my niece for her birthday, which isn't until like a couple of months time, but I'm trying to be organized this year because I suck at being last minute with people's gifts and I need to get on top of it. Especially now that I have a baby to look after and I have baby brain. And yes, I still have baby brain. And I think it's mostly just due to lack of sleep. I don't know why I'm functioning right now. In fact, I kind of do. I bought a coffee machine and I've been living off coffee. Co coffee. I am so excited about my coffee machine and um, I've been reluctant to buy one because um, it's one of the Nespresso ones. I didn't like the pods um, because they were plastic and I really didn't want to have so much extra plastic waste unnecessarily. Then I found a company because I was watching Rhiannon, Rhiannon, I think that's her name. Um, she's a vlogger on YouTube. And she got pods from a coffee maker called Grind from London. And you can put them into your brown bin, which is awesome. So I got those. I'm super excited to save myself some money and be able to make coffee from home because it has a little like frother at the side. So I'm gonna be able to froth up my oat milk in that. Um, so I'll probably show you that in like next week's video. That's how excited I am about it. Um, I'm like a child on Christmas morning when I got my coffee machine. <laughs> right, which bird? I've got purples in this, so I think I'm gonna try and get one with some purple in it. Let's put in, or do we want to contrast? Let's put in this one, this one's cute. Put this one in. So I also got my iPad and have been spending some time kind of doodling and drawing. So I'll be able to show you some progress on that. I started working on my project. Um, I think I mentioned it on my Instagram, but I'm starting to do like a matching card game project. So I'm doing all the illustrations for that at the minute. It's kind of like woodland, fairy, fantasy type feel to it. And uh, I've just been kind of working my way through some ideas for that. Um, so I will show you that probably in the next video as well. It's really fun. Really fun just kind of playing about and getting to grips with the iPad and it has made such a difference being able to take it portably because at the minute um, a lot of the time whenever I'm putting baby to sleep he naps on me which I don't mind. Um, it just means that I'm limited in what I can do but being able to have him held in a way I can sit and doodle while he's sleeping. So that's been really good because otherwise I would have to sit and like get out all my stuff to do traditional drawings. So it's been great being able to do it digitally with um, with the iPad and uh, actually feel like I'm being a bit more productive with that kind of time that I feel like I'm, I'm sort of stagnant just sitting there. Um, and I mean bonus because I get to draw and have cuddles at the same time. Um, let's see, I'm going to continue on with this page. I will check in and show you whenever I am finished. And then I'll show you the Ellis Willie stuff too. Okay, here is the finished spread. Very minimal. I just put my like main goal. This is mostly just for the start of the year. But I've got so that I want to launch my Etsy and start with just the kind of products that I want um, and when kind of to aim for and then this page is my word of the year which is sincere mostly because 
Um, I was going to say create, but then I thought, I'm going to create anyway. I want to choose the word sincere because I want the things that I do to be because I want to do them and I want to have fun um, and try not to be influenced externally too much. Like, and by that I mean, you know, when you go on Instagram and you see all the cool things that everybody else is doing and you start to wonder, you know, if what you're doing is like good enough. So I want to trust more in my own instincts of what it is I want to do and just kind of roll with having fun with it. Um, I want the process of starting a business. Um, so yeah, that's that. And finally, I can show you what I got from Ellis Woolley. Let's see, so I got this little freebie sticker. Super cute. Cute little business card and this is a like handwritten note. It's so cute. I'm gonna put this up on my wall too. Um, so this isn't for me, this is my niece. She is super into dinosaurs. Oh. Sorry. That was a timer for me to put on dinner. Um, anyway. So I got the Veggie Sores sticker pack. The Unicorn keychain. And the Dinosaur badge, button badge. So I'll have to keep those packed up for a few months, but I think she will love those. And yeah, that's everything so far. So wrapping up the week, uh, I've got quite a few things from some lovely small businesses. I have my goal sheet set up. My goals video was out last week. If you haven't seen it, I'll link it. Um, yeah, next week I think it's just going to be all about lots of drawing. Um, I did an exercise where I just did lots of really quick stuff. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll have seen it. Um, if not, I'll link below if you want to follow me there. So I can show you those. I can show you my process and get started showing you my card game design. But yeah, that's everything for this week. I hope you've all had a lovely week. And I shall see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Thank you.